we're gonna look at my sock collection. I have many socks. Um, these are not all of my socks, but these are all of the cool socks, the cool and interesting, fun socks that I love to collect and wear. We will start off with the pair that I'm wearing now. They're butterfly socks. Let me just take the sock off. That probably makes more sense. 10 out of 10. I love these. Do they match this outfit? I don't know. What is matching? Because I don't think I ever knew what it was. Because I never match, in my opinion. I don't know. I do match sometimes, but let's move on. Next are these. I think you guys have seen these before because um, I've worn them in like previous outfit of the day videos, but I'm so sorry, but they say dead inside on the side here. <laughs> I'm not dead inside, but I like these. I love stripes. And I love how stretchy they are. And they're good quality. So 11 out of 10. Should I rate all of these? They're all going to be 10s, probably. They're all probably going to be more than 8 out of 10. So yeah. Love these. They go with a lot. Love them. <coughs> Excuse me. I had too much caffeine today. Next. Pickle Rick. I do not watch um, Rick and Morty at the time that I bought them. I think I had a Hot Topic gift card and I decided to buy socks and I was like, oh, those are cool and they'll go with a lot of stuff. I don't watch the show. So if you ask me about Rick and Morty, I'm not going to have any answers. I'm so sorry. I'm a fake fan. But I'm gonna wear the socks anyway because they're cool and they match. Black goes with everything. Green goes with mostly everything. They're very thick. 11 out of 10. 9 out of 10 because I don't watch the show. Next, I actually don't wear these and they were just like buried in my drawer. Um, but maybe I should start wearing them because they're actually cute. Ooh. They're, they're not very stretchy so I don't think it's gonna be good for my blood circulation because they're gonna be squeezing my calves. I think they're knee highs. I don't think I've ever worn these in life except maybe like once. They're not very practical because if you can see they're mesh, I think. So they're very thin, but they have a bunch of colorful peace signs that are kind of like neon. So I'm probably gonna rate these seven out of 10 because I don't really wear them. These are my fuzzy socks. I love fuzzy socks. I love to wear these with my Birkenstock sandals. Yes, I am that person that wears socks with sandals. Sue me. I love these. They were a gift and I I think I've had them for like three years now. Um, and they, they have held up. I don't think there's any holes in them at all and they're still thick and fluffy and squishy and amazing and I love wearing them. I like to call these my cozy day socks because whenever like it rains or something or it's like cloudy and cold, I specifically wear these socks with my sandals and I'm like, yes. It just makes me happy. So 11 out of 10. Everything about these are great. And thank you to the person who gifted them to me. If, if they watch these videos, I don't know. Also from Hot Topic, these Goonies Never Say Die. Have you seen the Goonies? If you haven't, you have to watch it. And then they have um, the pirate skull on it. No spoilers, a classic. And again, with the neutral colors. So they match a lot of things and they're super quality. They're thick, they're warm, they're great. People will look at your socks and read them. Goonies never say die. I'm a goonie. Goonie for life. Mm. 
Next we have these. <laughs> so here's the funny thing about these. I feel like I've worn these in a video as well, but I can't remember. Um, hey Arnold socks. I think this character's name is Reggie. I can't remember. I should probably look it up. And then here's Arnold, obviously the main character with his football head. The funny thing is I actually wasn't a huge fan of Hey Arnold. I did used to watch it, but I wasn't like super into it. I think I would just like watch it when there was nothing else on, like no other cartoons that I wanted to watch. They're mismatched on purpose. This is how I bought them. And then they have like different camo print colors. It's hard to match these with things, but again, what is matching? Because I don't know. I love these though. They are actually, I think they're like thicker than these. So I'm not gonna give them 11 out of 10. 10 out of 10 because it's kind of hard to match them with stuff. I I don't think I've ever worn these. They are also like knee length, I think. But I love the design because as you can see, they're glittery. Look how glitter they are. And then they have this like ombre effect. I don't know what it's supposed to be. I think it's supposed to be like a fish fin um, or a mermaid. Fish scales and then the tail is on the end. I think they'll be cute if you like roll them down and have like a pretty basic outfit with them because you know, these are the showstopper right here. You don't want to overdo it. I mean, you can if you want, but I probably wouldn't overdo it. I, I don't know what I would do. It depends on the day. But yeah, I like these a lot. I should probably wear them more. Let's just try them on real quick to see if they're gonna, you know, cut off my circulation just for fun. I already feel my circulation getting cut off. I don't even think I can roll them all the way up my calf. <laughs> Drop me. Oh gosh, gravity. I can get them up my calf, but it is tight and I don't like that. I don't even want to show you guys. <laughs> Look at this. I mean, they're not super tight, but they're a bit more tight than I would like them to be. But to be honest, now that I think about it, a lot of my socks kind of like squeeze my calves because when I take them off, I have the little ring around my calf. Um, the impression that shows I was wearing tight socks for too long, I guess. But my feet, like my legs don't get numb or anything. I think it's just normal. Hopefully. Nine out of 10 because they're tight and um, I don't really wear them that much. More thick crew socks. And then here's the brand Cross, girl, you just wrote it. Cross Colors, goodness. I think it's a black owned brand. I don't remember where I purchased them. I feel like it might've been Ross. Ross has really great socks in the men's section and they typically, from what I've noticed, they typically switch them out pretty frequently so they get like new designs often. I'd rate these like 10 out of 10. I like these. These are actually, they're specifically from the sock store. There is a sock store franchise um, and we went to one, my mom and I went to one when we went out of town one time. And loving memory of sleep and then there's sheep on them. Look how cute. I love these. I really love these a lot. I guess this is the brand Blue Q. Nice handwriting. <laughs> 10 out of 10, maybe 9 out of 10. Just because they're kind of thin and I feel like the heel um, is kind of like thinning out and that uh, it might develop a hole soon. So, yeah. I probably wear these too much and so, you know. I don't know how much longer they're gonna last, but I'm like, don't tell anyone, but <laughs> I'm kind of that person that still wears socks, even if there's like a hole in them, <laughs> which is terrible. These are mismatched. No, these were not purchased this way. Um, what happened was I lost <laughs> the twin to both of these. So there was another striped one and there was another 
I guess this is cheetah print, leopard print. Um, I lost the match for both of them. I don't know how that happened. I don't remember when that happened, but I still had both of them. So I was just like, you know what? They're just gonna be mismatched. And I wear them that way. And I have no shame. I love these, 11 out of 10. I've had these, I've had these for a while. I think like years. I think I may have gotten these in high school. So if that's true, I've had them for at least six years and they're still holding up like brand new. So period. Wow. I ordered these online and I completely forgot I had them until literally today. That's socially awkward. That's the only design. The design is very like cheap, which, you know, is to be expected because I think these were only like a dollar or something. After a couple more washes, the sticker will probably completely burn off because I think it's literally like... Do you guys know like the temporary tattoos and how when you, you put them on with water, right? And then you can sometimes if you don't leave the, um, the pressure and the hot water on long enough, when you take the rag off, it'll just peel off. That's what these remind me of. It reminds me of a peel off temporary tattoo. So with these, probably gonna have to give these six out of 10, not just because it's the cheap design, but also because like there's nothing else going on with these. Probably the lowest rating so far, six out of 10, but I bought them, you know, that's on me. I take full responsibility. So these were a gift from my mom and they just have a bunch of little birds on them and they're super cute and I love them. And I think she got them from the sock store, but I'm not 100% sure, but I love these. So 11 out of 10. Oh, I love these. These might be like in my top three. Where did I get these? I can't remember where I got them, but um, just, just take a minute to look at them. <laughs> they say hot mess on them with a trash can and a pink heart. It's self-explanatory. I mean, if you get it, you get it. You know, if you know, you know. I love these. 12 out of 10. 12 out of 10 gold blooms. Great quality, super cute. I wear these a lot. Can't remember where I got them. Yay, kitties. I love kitties. And they just say meow, 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 meow. Do you guys remember that commercial? I don't know. I probably just watched too much TV as a kid, but there was this Meow Mix commercial. Um, meow Mix is like a cat food brand. And every time it would come on, they had the little Meow Mix song in the background. And it's literally cats going meow, 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 meow. And that was the song. 10 out of 10. I love these. 11 out of 10. They were my missing sock cubby. So I have like a little box. It's not a cubby, it's a box. Um, where I keep my pajamas and all of the socks to which I lost the twin pair. And I found out that both of these were in there and I was like, oh wow, cool. All is not lost. I love these. These were also a gift, I believe. Um, and they, oh, it's like galaxy print and then on the other side is like NASA space astro core I guess I love these yes great quality 10 out of 10 because I haven't worn them in a long time because I didn't know that they were even lost I completely forgot I feel terrible we have another pair of fuzzy socks that are also mismatched what happened again yes I lost the twin pair for both of these so but they match i think they came in the same set like it was like a pack of three technically they match um because they've held up so long 11 out of 10. fuzzy socks yes banana banana is one of my favorite fruits so of course i had to get a pair of socks with bananas on them and they're yellow and that's all there is to it very quality stitching do you see this Yes, 10 out of 10, love these. 
I'm kind of a horror movie fanatic, so don't judge me. Although I haven't watched any horror movies in a while. Not true. I haven't watched any new horror movies in a while. Um, but I know, I know. It's Pennywise from the Stephen King It remake. And then it has the boat. If you've seen the movie, if you read the book, I haven't read the book. I've only seen the movie. I saw the original. I've seen the remake. And so these are also from Hot Topic. There's a funny story behind a time that I wore these, but I don't think I can share it because I might get in trouble. So I'm just not going to share it. But yeah, love these. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Next, these socks are dirty because I've already worn them in the last week or two, but I still wanted to include them in the video. I'll just share one at a time. Cats, also a gift. Love these, all the different cats. Neutral colored, good quality, 11 out of 10. They match with a lot of stuff. They're super cute. Cats, you just can't go wrong. I don't think I know where the match to this sock is, but I will include this in the collection. It's just stripes. Nothing, you know, nothing extraordinary. But I really love these. Yeah, I don't know. 10 out of 10. <laughs> I'm trying to go quick now because I didn't expect for this video to be so long. I'm so sorry. Next, I love these. They're kind of basic, but I still love them um, because of what they say. There's a message behind them. Let's read it. Antisocial. That's it. It just says antisocial. Butterfly. Do you get it? Do you get it? Because social butterfly. And then, anyway, yes. 10 out of 10. Gray, neutral. It has a butterfly. It has a message. 11 out of 10. You know what? 11 out of 10. Next. There's a sad story today about these because. First of all, just take a look. Look at how cute. It has everything you could ever want. Flowers, yellow, cows, grass, the blue accent, color contrast, everything you could ever want in a sock is here. However, I don't know where the twin is. It's not in my missing sock cubby. It's not in my closet. It's not in my bed. I don't know where it went. Hopefully the dryer didn't eat it, which I don't know, is that a myth? But we will celebrate on the day that the lost sock returns because I love these 12 out of 10, probably in my top three. I have a little bit of favoritism toward cow. <laughs> toward cow. <laughs> what does that even mean? I don't eat beef. Rarely, rarely do I eat beef, um, but cow print. I really love cow print anything. Like if it's cow print, I'm gonna love it. And if it's cow, I'm gonna love it probably. Like Look at it! Look at it! Look at how cute it is. It's one of those, is it a pillow pet? It is, it's a pillow. It's a pet, it's a pillow pet. Velcro doesn't work anymore, so I can't do the thing, but it's supposed to go like this and then it's like a stuffed animal toy. But I just put it on my chair as extra back support. But it's a cow, okay? I love cow print anything. I have cow print shoes. They're vegan. Although I'm not vegan, but I'm just saying they're vegan. But yes, that is why I love these because they have the cows and they're just so cute. Like look at the, let's look again. Look at the detail here. Do you see that? It has everything. <laughs> It's a real depiction. I love these. So hopefully I find the missing um, pair. 12 out of 10. Can't believe this video is gonna be almost 30 minutes. I am a terrible person. Why? It's fine. Okay, next, yes. Oh. Yellow again with a happy face. There's multiple happy faces. Okay, I guess there's only two. And then I think there's a star. Yeah, there's a white star. 
I don't know what it means, but I love it. I wear these even when I'm not happy. 12 out of 10, probably in my top, did I already name three that have 12 out of 10? Top five, we'll just, it's a top five now. Love these. These, as you can already see, there's a hole in them. I have no idea how it happened. I don't know, like how? These are thick socks. I don't know what happened, but they have the cute little colorful stripes and then they're white with the pink. I love these. I'm really sad that there's a hole, but I still wear them. If they develop a second hole, then it might be time to give it up, but I'm holding on. You can't see the hole when I wear the shoes, so is it really there? Haha. <laughs> Honorable mention, and I don't even know why I'm including these, but these are a pair of tights, <laughs> but they're stripes. And look how cute and colorful. They're footless. I haven't worn these in a while, but I really love these. So that's it. That's my sock collection, my cool sock collection. Everything else is just boring, black and white socks. My collection will continue to grow. I hope to invest in some like frilly lace dress socks soon because I have been looking for those for a while. I actually found a few pair but I didn't order them because I was like, uh. Thank you guys for <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I'm so sorry that this was so long. Hopefully I can cut it down um, to like 20 minutes or less because girl it's a video about socks see you guys in the next one we'll see if i can juggle real quick okay hold on can i do three i already know i can't but we'll try uh, nope okay one more time